Hello and welcome to the Maintenance Corner. Today we're going to be looking at the Protometer ReachMaster Pro, which is a brand new non-invasive moisture meter from Protometer. In this video I'm going to give a quick overview of the device and run through some of its main features. The ReachMaster Pro is the brand new non-invasive moisture meter from Protometer. The first thing to say is that the Protometer ReachMaster Pro is very reminiscent of the modern Protometer range in terms of colour and texture. This for me is a good thing as I think Protometer have nailed the look and feel of these meters in their lineup. This meter has three main components which are the telescopic handle, the display unit and the sensor unit. The telescopic handle feels very robust. The grip is made from a grey rubbery non-slip material and it has grooves for the fingers which make it even steadier in the hand. The telescopic pole has a yellow rocker switch which allows it to extend. It has six 80mm increments allowing for a full extended range of well over a metre. The extendable meter will make hard to reach areas much more manageable as well as drastically speeding up your survey time. The display unit is set on a hinge so you can face it towards you when you are taking readings and then fold it away when you are finished. It takes four AA batteries which are covered by a sliding back plate. This will give you around 80 hours of continual use. The sensor unit on the end of the unit is also set on a hinge, which allows for a good range of movement, meaning you will be able to test just about every type of surface that you encounter. This unit takes two AA batteries, which you can access by removing two small screws. This will give you around 500 hours of continual use, meaning that you really won't need to change these batteries very often. On the end of the sensor unit, you'll find the replaceable abrasion plate, which is fixed in place by four screws. A spare abrasion plate is also provided so you can swap it out if needed. I would advise you, however, to place the unit on the surface rather than swiping it across, as this will keep the meter and the abrasion plate in good order for longer. Depending on the material being tested, the ReachMaster Pro will penetrate around 120 millimeters into the surface, allowing you to detect moisture non-invasively. The meter has a range from zero to a thousand, and this will go from green to yellow to red, depending on the value observed. To turn on the meter, you simply press the power button on the sensor unit, and then the same again for the display unit. They will both then automatically connect through Bluetooth. You can press the hold button on the display unit, which will freeze the value on the screen. This will come in handy if you are measuring an awkward space and you need the time to take note of the reading. The meter also has a reference mode, which allows you to test an area to get a dry standard reading, and then compare that to other areas with this original reading. You can change the sensitivity of the sensor as well. To access this feature, you simply hold down the plus or minus button for two seconds and then hold one to increase or decrease the sensitivity. There is a scale from minus five to plus five in sensitivity. This may be useful when taking readings on the very high or low end of the scale. After using this meter a bunch of times, I found it to be really useful and I think it would be a good complement to any surveyor's existing kit. It also allows you to zip round a property and easily access areas which would have previously only been accessible by ladder for high areas or by kneeling down for low areas. And finally, it allows you that extra depth of reading which will assist you in a wider variety of dampness cases, opening up more possibilities to investigate 
deeper into the substrate non-invasively. For the full review and my impressions, as well as a detailed breakdown of how this meter works, please go to themaintenancecorner.com. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. Thanks very much.